Hey, good morning, New Hope family. This is Pastor Damien, and look, look behind me. I, 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 done, I done got my sidekick in the office this morning. What's up? Say hey, Heather. Good morning. <laughs> Listen, few announcements for this week. Don't forget, this is Holy Week. And so from, from Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, I will be bringing a brief devotion each morning. I know you probably say, Pastor, man, we get tired of all these emails and all this stuff. But hey, how else am I going to get over to you what we're trying to trying to get done is that we have to get information out to you via email. Amen. Speaking of email and your family update, listen, family, this is what we need from you. This is what we need from you. We need... We need you to be able to um, send us an email, one new hope for all at gmail.com. One new hope for all at gmail.com. Ain't that right, Heather? That's it. All right, one new hope uh, for all at gmail.com. We need you to email all of your information. Listen, if you got five to ten personal email addresses, just send us the best one. Yeah that you have. And please email that information. Uh, or we may just send you something and have you send it back to us so that we can make sure that everyone is getting all this content that we're putting out and that nobody can say that they are lost, that they don't know, that they uh, didn't get it. And so uh, for those of you who have not gotten information, we apologize. And so I uh, haven't been, uh, her and Miss Darlene haven't been working from home and now are uh, going to be here one day a week uh, until all this is over. And so we want to make sure that we get all of that information fr uh, from you, your name, your family name, your address, your best email and a good phone number. All right. All right. So, so that's that for that. So don't forget, you can continually mail your gifts to 5002 South Central Expressway, Dallas, Texas, 75215 or Download the Tithely app, and then downloading the Tithely app, we need you to put your information in there. We're working on doing some other things so that you can be able to give three or four different ways at one time. We're trying to figure out if we can do that. I'll get back to you about that information. So, so don't forget to download the Tithely app. You can give there. Don't forget to get uh, uh, send information to your gifts to five thousand two South Central Expressway, Dallas, Texas. 75215, make that out to New Hope Baptist Church uh, when you're mailing your information over. That's the only way our postman really knows. He don't necessarily know church address. He does, but he really goes by by you making sure it's coming to New Hope Baptist Church. So don't forget, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, I'll be doing a free uh, brief devotions this week. Don't forget, we're going to have Monday, Thursday, this Thursday, and hang out and have communion and have the seven layer sands with some of our with our ministers and then a couple of the pastors, friends in the community. We're not going to be able to have that now. But we will be doing a devotion, talking about this triumphal entry that's leading us to Calvary, uh, and our Lord's death and ultimately his resurrection. Now, Wednesday at high noon, we will have our, uh, our, our midweek Bible study. So please make sure that you are looking for in your email the, the Zoom information. Okay, the Zoom information will be coming from the church uh, where you can log in or call in. It's going to be a 346 Houston number where you can call in. And when you do that, you'll be able to get on the call. Uh, if you don't have a computer, if you don't have Wi-Fi or anything like that, you can call in or get on Zoom. Last week we had up to 20 something. I want to have about 30 to 40 of us on the call. Worship was off the chain yesterday. Our first Zoom live, we had 52 people total who got on. And so we're grateful for that. Had a wonderful time of, uh, and we'll start doing that uh, moving forward. Now, this weekend, going to offer two worship services. We're going to go live at 1045 on Saturday, as if it's Sunday. And we're going to do it again at 1045 Zoom on Sunday. Okay. So we're going to do it at 1045 live on Saturday. You, so we have that, but then we're going to Zoom on Sunday. Everybody and their mama, you know, on Easter comes to church on Easter, Mother's Day, and Christmas. We call them CME people, Christmas, Mother's Day, and Easter. And Easter, uh, there, it is being said that the internet may, may break. Uh, if church looks like what it typically looks like, they're saying the internet may just go crazy and we don't want to have any glitches going live or anything like that. So we're going to offer two worship services. We will go live on Saturday, but then you'll get a chance to hear the same identical message if you're not live on Saturday. 
we'll hear the same identical message on Sunday during our New Hope Zoom worship. Aren't you glad that we have now come full circle into the technological age, church? Aren't you glad that you and I can see each other's faces? We can see into each other's eyes and we can cry together and worship together. While I long to see you and worship in this building we call sanctuary, uh, I'm grateful for technology. And church, we've come full circle. So listen, in about three weeks, our new website, newhopedallas.org, should be up and running. Brother Cedric, you are the real MVP, my brother. Deacon Cedric Haggerty, thank you, man, for helping me with this. And I'm looking forward to, to us putting this together and getting this out to our church. Listen, listen, uh, whatever you do, be safe. Make sure you're taking care of yourself. Don't leave the house unless you just have to leave the house. And remember, if you need us, I'll be here Monday. Uh, I'll be here Wednesday. I'll be here Thursday. And uh, just give us a call, 214-421-5296. Listen, remember, we love you, and there's nothing you can do about it. And I'm reminded of that passage of Scripture where Jesus is there in the garden of Gethsemane with he and his boys. He asked them to go and to just watch for him while he goes to pray. Long story short, he comes back on the third time and see that they've been sleeping. Gethsemane means crushing place. And he knew that he had to die for both you and I. The good news of the text is that he didn't leave, but he asked his father a question, Lord, if it be possible, daddy, let this bitter cup be passed for me. Yet, nevertheless, not my will, but your will be done. Aren't you glad that over 2,000 years ago, Jesus went to Calvary? And not only did he go to Calvary, but he died. But that's not how the story ends. Three days later, he rose again. And that's love. i see you later on, New Hope. I love you. Can't wait to see you. Bye-bye. Tyler says bye. Look like Mr. Rome then walked up in here on us as well. Hey, we'll talk to you later. Take care now. Bye-bye.